வந்தேகம் The following is a conversation with His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on the 3rd of November, 1973, in Delhi, India. Uh, 
So why not here? Why go to Baba Road, spend twenty rupees? I'm going to uh, then that they sometimes they have to go in the center of town. Nobody has an intention. It is it will not stay, it is for this part. Joint mess organization. In Los Angeles, they are also doing business. They are going to say no. But regulative principle is up there. In the expenditure they have got, no center is so improved in Los Angeles. You have purchased six houses, and I want to immediately two lakhs immediately sent. You cannot pay. You simply want to take. In India, nobody can pay. If I want two lakhs, nobody can pay. All this money has been taken from U.S. I asked Bhadimad, then I asked Karandha. They paid me for this bomb bank, 16, 18 lakhs. It goes very slow. Therefore, he cannot be immortal. And Bhagavad Gita proposes that is what happens. You can stop. Death. And a whole spiritual life means how to stop death. That is Bhagavad instruction. Don't accept Guru, don't accept Father, don't accept Him. Or don't be Father, don't be Mother, don't. You cannot stop death. I then don't accept or don't be God. That's why right. they want Guru. So don't accept a Guru who cannot stop your death. And from Guru's side it is advised, don't become Guru if you cannot stop the death of the Vishnu. This is Bhagavad so our Krishna consciousness moment is to stop death, leave eternity, leave Krishna, go back to home, back to God. This is our moment. So our Guru gives us this opportunity. No more death. Tatka, this, after leaving this body, you don't accept any more material body. And if you don't accept material body, then there is no death. As soon as you are spiritual, you remain in spiritual body. There is no death. There is no birth also. Death is concomitant, where birth is there. If the death is stopped, then there is no birth. And if there is no birth, there is no disease, there is no death. This is birth. So birth, death, old age, disease can be stopped only by Krishna consciousness. So if you don't like to be Krishna consciousness, then what is the use of becoming your disciple? I mean, the Guru, if you cannot stop your death, birth and death, then what is your become becoming Guru? Samurtattaya kalpa. Jamhi na bhadhante ti purusham purusham samur. Find out this verse. Jamhi na bhadhante ti te. Why am? Here, why am? Jamhi. Get this line now. There is birth and death all there. There is There is Sydney. There is birth and death. These rascals are making plans, material plans. Jala and Nehru make plans of this new building. But he is kicked out. Guards. And now he has become a dog in Switzerland. Switzerland. <laughs> Yes, Sridhar Maharaj told me, some astrologer. These so-called leaders are so fools. Therefore they don't believe next life, because that is very horrible for them. But the next life is there, this life. We have our next life, we had our previous life, then another life, another life. But the simple thing they cannot understand. Nature is controlling this. Next life, next life. Otherwise, why so many varieties of life? So they have no brain. They are simply making plan for the fifty years duration of life. And even from practical point of view, suppose you are constructing a very nice house, and if you know the next day you will be kicked out, you will die, will you do that? But it is a fact. Next day or two days after you will die. That's a fact. So, first of all, Make arrangements that you will not die. You will be able to live here. And that is a foolishness. 
sometimes they take refuge in the idea that my family will live on for my species. My That's all right. Children. The family will live on not forever. They live on also for a few days. We go sometimes, uh, just like in England, uh, the castles are there, very old castles, thousand years, two thousand years in this. And uh, Westminster Abbey and palace. Uh, but which king has lived her there permanently? And now, if you know more, if the king has by his wife to become something else, not necessarily he will become a king in that house. He may become a dog. These sons they do not know. And they are proud of their education, culture. Suppose you have construction with the Vrindavan temple or Bombay temple. It is also certain we shall not live. But our attempt to construct that temple will be recorded in Krishna. Yes. Because he has spent his energy for my service. And that is the temple. Others, whatever they are working, who are three after, avajatāna sadhara What about this one? This is in Bhagavad. Yes. Tattva sadhammam charanam bhujam hare. Bhajan napakku tu patit tatu jivi. Jatra ku jatra avhatra avhut amusakin. Kuvatriyatu avhatitam sadhammam. Tattva sadhammam charanam mujam hari. Just like many of her disciples, as a matter of civilized man, they should have remained at home, obedient to the parents, get married and live peacefully with father and mother. Of course, the European American boys do not do that, but it is expected that should be like that, just like yourself. You should have lived with your father, he also. But he did not do this. So take it for granted out of sentiment he took to Krishna consciousness. The class of Dharma, to lead family life, peaceful life, obedient life to the fathers and mothers, this is called Sadharma. So one gives us this Sadharma. The class of Dharma attacks to Krishna consciousness, surrenders to Krishna. But somewhere or other, by his bad association, by his mild strip, again he falls down. Just like many of our students have gone. Not many, a few. So Bhagavad says, tatra ahatra avut avusyakin. Now what is the wrong there? Even if he has fallen down halfway, still there is no wrong. He has gained something. That much service which has already given to Krishna, that is a card. That is a card. That is to his credit. So this living entity has given charges. But other man is very honestly living as a good citizen, as a good family member, as a good Brahman, good uh, Chatriya. Uh, so Kuma Artha after he is sticking to his own principle of life, but he is not a Krishna conscious devotee. So what is his gain? He will simply take the fruits of his material activities and he will have to accept another body according to that. But here, as it is assured in Bhagavad Gita, that Sujinam Simutangi he Yoga Bhrasta Sanjaya, this man, who took by sentiment Krishna consciousness but could not follow it to the end by some or other he has fallen. But he will be given chance to take birth as a human being guaranteed in this family or in this nice devoted family, yogi family or Brahman family. So he will be given chance. But that man will take only the reaction of his activities. If he has acted like cats and dogs, he can But here it is guaranteed. Here it is guaranteed that he is going to be another human body and very nice family. Is that 
guarantee that he'll become a devotee again? Yes, because he has already practiced. So if he, if he remembers, if he is interior, I have got this nice position according to Shastra because I had some good devotional activities in my past life. Now let me finish. I have not found that. I have no economic problem. I have got so much facilities. Oh, let me advance in Krishna consciousness. If he gets that, he will get that sense. He automatically gets that sense. But he must come back to that point again, starting there. That's why here your children have given the good chance. Ah, yeah. The Saraswati is giving chance. Now he is a problem. Many times he is chanting Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna, Krishna. He is criticizing. Malati, this old man is smoking. <laughs> he is giving the sanskar from the childhood. And we got it from good father. Yes. So there is a chance, and that is not, it is not childish. Sarsat is chanting Hari Krishna. In London, she would finish sixty times. Six. Six. Yes. They see, she has got determination. And all the children. So that is not going there. Yeah. Never going there. This is, she had executed devotional service in her past life. That was from the very beginning of her life. She is an association. And beginning. This is the chance. Now it is the duty of the father and mother, and when she grows up, it is her duty to finish this business, go to back home. This is the chance. So, where is the loss? If we see fail last life, then where is the loss? She is getting another chance. Whereas the ordinary economy, they will not get that chance. That is expected. Isn't it? One who has forsaken his material occupation to engage in the devotional service of the Lord may sometimes fall down while in an immature stage, yet there is no danger of his being un unsuccessful. On the other hand, a non devotee, though fully engaged in occupational duties, does not gain anything. That is a translation. Bad, bad. As far as the duties of mankind are concerned, there are innumerable duties. Every man is duty-bound not only to his parents, family members, society, country, humanity, other living beings, the demigods, etc., but also to the great philosophers, poets, scientists, etc. It is enjoined in the scriptures that one can relinquish all such duties and surrender unto the service of the Lord. So if one does so and becomes successful in the discharge of his devotional service unto the Lord, it is well and good. But it so happens sometimes that one surrenders himself unto the service of the Lord, by some temporary sentiment, and in the long run, due to so many other reasons, he falls down from the path of service by undesirable association. There are so many instances of this in the histories. Bharat Maharaj was obliged to take his birth as a stag due to his intimate attachment to a stag. He thought of this stag when he died. As such, in the next birth he became a stag, although he did not forget the incidents of his previous birth. Similarly, K2 also fell down due to his... We are only forbid to take to the Kormi's life. Because at the time of death, if he remains a Kormi, then you have to take birth as a Kormi. That is the reason. So this regulative life, Holding class, chanting, that will not make us fall down. Mm -hmm. That is essential. It is essential. Regular to follow the regulative principle, chanting, sitting down, holding class. You can do anything, but this will keep us aligned to the Krishna consciousness platform. If you neglect that, then there is this. Even if you get next night, birth in a rich man's family, and that is not guarantee. Because generally rich men's sons, they go astray. They get money for nothing and they want to squander it. And material world, if you have got money, so many bad associates will come and help you to squander your money and spoil your life. Because you have got money, there are so many friends will come. 
as soon as you have no money, nobody will come. Even your wife, children will not come. <laughs> now you see that dhanam samadhi. Krishna first of all takes away the money. He makes him poor so that everyone will neglect him. And because he's Krishna conscious, he will take Krishna. <laughs> I have no other <laughs> Please give me protection. That is also another Krishna's policy. Special favor. But this man wanted me, now he is going astray, all right. That's all right. Take everything, everything. <laughs> that was my case also. <laughs> Since I, my Bhuma ordered me that you do this, but I, I thought that let me become first of all this man, then I said do. So I believe in this that is all. <laughs> That is special thing. In the beginning I was thinking, like my godbrothers have taken sannyas, they are begging door to door, I said, let me add money and start Krishna Krishna. That never happened. So I had to, I was obliged to take the dress of my godbrother, bleach, in some earning money. <laughs> Some astrologer told me that I should have been a man like a Billa. And I got all those chances in the chemical line to become. Now I'm bigger than Billa, that's all right. But even in business things, they were fine. <laughs> there is money coming. I got so many good chances. But everything. <laughs> Dr. Kati Chandra was he appreciated my activity. Very intelligent boy. He certified to my parents in love. This is the way I'm becoming rich man. What happened? Why? Huh? Why your business? Something happened. I mean, everything was <laughs> finished. That, that is Krishna's deal. That's why something happened wonderful. That is also Krishna's deal. People stopped purchasing? Huh? People stopped purchasing? No. Just like Dr. Moses' laboratory. I was manager. Then I took his agency. Very good terms. I was earning money like anything. But the next manager, he became envious. He began to poison Dr. Bose, to cut off our relations. Very little time. Then when I was Dr. Bose's agent, I became so much famous that Bengal Chemical, the biggest chemical factory, they wanted to give me the agency. If I had taken that agency, I would have been the richest man in the chemical world, you see. But they made some condition why did not accept it. I wanted in my condition. That is very little, but I was popped up. <laughs> when I am such a big and big man is flattering, so I must get my condition full big. So I did not accept it. It's mischievous to get me agents, because I am in, the, in my work in Dr. Moses' laboratory. I did it very creditably. So every other manufacturer, they become attracted to me. How to get me? The Smith Statistics Company, BK Pal Company, Bose's, uh, Bengal Chemical Company, they all wanted me. And I thought, oh, everyone wants me. <laughs> so I refused. A little on, I, I, there was click with them, Dr. Bose and me. So I lost everything. Then I started my own laboratory. Some or other, there was something. In Bombay, you have your own business then? Yes. Manufacturing? Yes. So that is small manufacturing. So I got very, very good chance. But Krishna did not allow me. He wanted me to come to this point. That is my practical experience. And now I say that this is Krishna's so much favor. So the sound and grammar it is his, actually it is his grace. What will you do by becoming Billa, like rich man like Billa? That was Krishna's plan. Come here, do this work. My Guru Maharaj ordered, Krishna wanted, I was resisting him. I was actually a very expert businessman in technical life. I did it very creditably in both his laboratory as manager and my own business and everyone knows. Even in manufacturing also. In that same experience, now you've organized a worldwide society 
Yeah. yeah. That's a big business. Yeah. Yeah. It's difficult. Uh, it's like uh, before coming to India, you in Japan, simply five thousand dollars. Yeah. You took fifty thousand dollars worth of merchandise. Yeah. And you brought it. Yeah. yeah. Had it sent, and then uh, like mm-hmm. everything. Yeah. And you devise the program for the well, yes, city. practically Indians are whatever they have got, it is starting with that high time. No, no, no. It's like you were investing, taking goods on credit. Yes. And, uh, uh, and this membership yes. that becomes a system. Then you can devise the method for distribution. This membership. <laughs> Even the way you went to America in the beginning, you couldn't take money, no. so you had some books. Some books. <laughs> <laughs> That intelligence gives me to do this. Buddhi Jogam Dadarita. Yes. And by materialistic value, you are taking out my interview. Just like this posing man, Bengal Chemical Agency. I should have accepted immediately. Such a big concern. Simply by sitting, I would have brought ten thousand rupees per month in those days. But there was no good, good intelligence. I thought, no, I cannot accept your time. You must accept. Because I was at that a young man, Papa. No brain. <laughs> no sugar brain. They are so attracted with me. They would have given letter on all facilities, but I did not accept. Similarly, Smith Dynasty, they are also very big company. Smith Dynasty is an English company. They gave me an English. So some of my enemy, he was my, he was my employer. But he gave me information that I am also manufacturing now, dragon chemical work. So we informed that, that he is pushing his own goods, not your goods. They, he wanted that image. In this way, because as soon as you come into the, even in the spiritual field, my God brothers are enemy. So as soon as you become successful, there will be many enemies. That is natural. That is the sign of success. In your business, if there are many enemies, competitors, that means you are successful. So anyway, Krishna has brought me to the right path. So I may not fall down this. <laughs> When I was reading this verse, the Jasavana Grindami Harisheta Dhanam Sadi, Krishna said that he, when I show somebody my special favor, I take away all his money, I become sadder. So Krishna will take my own money. If he just <laughs> actually that happened. He took my own money, all family, all friends and everything. <laughs> <laughs> and he asked, go to America, you'll get much money, many friends. You go ahead, come here. <laughs> that was his intention. And I was taking to limited money, limited friends, limited society. This is special. Like in Bombay, you mentioned that the Lama Himachi, there was one house. Yes. And you were trying to get that house. Yes, and she took her. She took her. Because I was trying to organize the League of Devotees from that house. And Krishna wondered, what is this nonsense? You stick here, jazzy. Come, yeah, it's an open field. That was Krishna written. But I thought that in Krishna took out of this. This is our thing. Now But my intention was to start this woman. Yeah. I was simply planning in divine. And therefore Krishna said, I never deviated from this plan. Since I heard it from my Guru Mahārāja, I was simply planning how to do it successfully. But I thought at that time that I will be able to do it if I get some money. Let me do some business for the time. That was the thinking. But Krishna said, even if you are a pauper, you try it, you will get everything. But I thought without money, how is this can be? That was defense of opinion with Krishna or Guru and I was dreaming also. Guru Maharaj has said, come on. So I was going. So I was saying, oh, I have to go. I have to take some rest. You're, you're dreaming? Yes. 
Gunain ke kan kan ini. Ayo gunain. Many things happen before this. And at last you get them. Get out of here. Did you tell everyone you were leaving or you simply disappeared? No, I didn't. Then I said, oh, why is it? I lost all friends, money, everything. I met one gentleman from Alabama. Ah, yeah, yeah. Oh. It's, but it's like this point, and we have done big nicely. It is the greatest moment for making the whole human civilization happy. Take it seriously.